school community success and recognition. As you can see, building and sustaining a strong school community takes a lot of hard work. Following the building blocks of communication, education, and connection helps to ensure that everyone understands their role and has opportunities to perform it successfully. When roles are performed successfully, accomplishments are achieved. There is nothing more satisfying than hard-earned gains. School communities must seize these opportunities to celebrate and find ways to recognize the contributions of its members, which our final three indicators address. School celebrates its accomplishments. School recognizes the individual accomplishments of teachers. And the school recognizes the accomplishment of teams. Let's watch and listen as these school community members discuss the accomplishments they've achieved and share some unique and fun ways they've brought their community together to celebrate. Warning, great ideas follow. Whether it's for student accomplishments or you know for teachers or parents, but um, one big thing that we do for students is every month we have a spirit day, and then um, at the end of each quarter we have quarterly awards. At our spirit day activities, we usually have maybe a brief performance by our students, and we reward them for accomplishments throughout the month. At our quarterly award ceremony, we reward students for academic accomplishments or uh, behavioral things. Um, behavior on the bus, um, whether they brought a great idea to school. So we do all of those things in front of the entire student body and parents. We send out invitations to our parents and other community members to join us. We also at that time recognize parents who may have donated their time or some other product to our school to help make our school run a little bit better. So those accomplishments add uh, power to what we do because kids look forward to that and parents and teachers. <laughs> Caught Red Handed is basically a reward program for students. If they do something that helps the community, helps the rest of the school, like a bake sale or putting together something to drive donations for we have a teacher whose son is sick in the hospital, uh, basically a reward system where you did something great in our school and now everyone can see you've done something. So it's more a recognition program. Uh, usually a pretty good thing. I mean, people get to see your name. It's like I accomplished something. You get to see it up there when you walk by. Yeah, yeah. kind of a fun experience. Lauren, I had the idea of you know, there's all these parents that do all this work around, you know, just little things here, like you were mentioning, little things here and there, might be big things, might be sort of running a program, like the winter sports program, uh, but just, I don't know that there's enough opportunity that we take to acknowledge them. So we were thinking something sort of little, little thing that we could do to, you know, engage them, acknowledge them, and, and make it sort of fun. So here's the pond where the frogs are hanging out, and the, the frogs is the, you know, friends and relatives of Oak Grove School, acronym that we have. So that, that's the theme, and then, you know, big thanks to them, and then we, these are lily pads that will move around, you know, that are hopefully going to move around up, you know, down here all the way up to the parent room is the hope. And, um, and just, again, it's like some, some people maybe chopped up some vegetables, some people are, you know, doing, they did some arts and crafts with uh, some of the evening events. Um, I think Lauren's up here like 17 times or something. <laughs> we had to put her in a bunch. So, so that's the hope, and just, again, letting people know that we appreciate what, what they've been doing. Today we're having a celebration for the hard work that On we put into boosting our parental involvement students. in our school. Last year we did a lot of work. We um, created a parental, parental involvement team of teachers. Um, we <laughs> had parents on that team and we sat down and we looked at the strengths and challenges of our school as it related to our parents and community. And we looked at why our parents weren't coming in, weren't coming in so much. So we developed strategies to go out and basically recruit parents to come in. So today we're having a celebration for all of the work that the teachers put into that project and uh, for their dedication and commitment to making things happen here in our school.